So everyone on YouTube decided that for one week, we would all try to wake up at 5 a.m. And at our own free will. And here's how it went for me. Okay, so for this week, I decided I'm going to wake up every single day of this week at 5 a.m. Why? I don't really know. There's actually a couple of reasons why I think I should be doing it. A, I've been waking up at 11 a.m. every day. That's not good. That's when I start class. Another reason is I haven't been eating breakfast because I wake up at 11. So I'll wake up at 11 and my first meal will be at like at 4. Yeah. So my goal is to wake up, do what I need to do, have like an actual morning routine, eat a proper meal, have a bunch of time to myself, actually do the things I want to do, not wake up and by the time like my brain is awake, it's time to go back to sleep. So yeah. Also, I have a little secret. I already tried recording this and filming this video twice. So yeah, here's the clip. And today's Monday, so like I kind of am starting on a, I'm gonna start on Tuesday. Just because I just randomly thought to do this because I need something to do. I literally would put my alarm on at 5 a.m., wake up at 5, and it felt illegal. It felt illegal to be awake because it was so dark. But you know what, I'm gonna push through and try it. So I'm gonna try it and see if it's meant for me and just see if it's life changing or not. So yeah, I'll see you tomorrow at 5 a.m. for real this time, okay? Okay, so we're in the bathroom. You guys need to use, I, I wouldn't recommend this exact toothpaste, but fluoride free toothpaste. I'm not gonna say why, just trust me. And don't use fluoride toothpaste. It's a little bit later now. The sun has come up, obviously. So now I'm gonna clean. I'm gonna do my bed. So I guess you can watch me do that. Hey, that was good. Also, don't forget to drink your water. Uh, my camera's gonna die. Okay. Let's go. So, 
I journaled, I wrote out my plans for the week, and now I'm just cleaning. <clears throat> this, and ooh! Very, it's so simple, yet I refuse to do it. I feel like I need to set the mood, but first, I want to drink like, whoa, I just want to drink at least like three of those because I can't even do that. Okay, I got this new incense stick. It's a good health one, which seems very fitting. Oh, it smells good. Tomorrow is going to be a new day. Whoa. Today's tomorrow is going to be a new day where I actually do it properly because my camera won't be dead. Do this at your own risk. And don't set your house on fire. Okay. Ready, set. Oh no, I know. Literally nothing special. Sweat, graphic tea. Where could you go wrong? I refuse to take. I refuse to take morning showers because it also feels illegal. I don't know. I feel like it just like doesn't make sense to me sometimes. I use Bear Glove by Old Spice. My friend put me on because it smells. It's like not too strong. But it also gets the job done because women's deodorant just doesn't do that for me. So do what you will with that information. I bought an electric guitar impulsively because I watched someone play it and I was like, okay, I need to pick up a new hobby. And that I decided to be the electric guitar. So I bought a really cheap one on Amazon. It was gonna invest in something that I knew I would never touch again maybe, I don't know. So, I'm gonna practice, even though I don't know anything. Let's see. And my amp is, sounds terrible. And it's probably not in tune. But I'm just gonna play something because it just feels great. Okay, let's not judge me. I okay, can't even remember. today today's morning of me waking up at five um it was kind of a fail i feel like i could have done way better but it's okay it's the day one i didn't know what to expect and how i would react but now i do and so i know what to do Okay, so I did homework until the sun rose up and so I don't make any noise and now the sun is up and so I'm going to write in my journal and write my dream for today. earlier so now I'm finally getting out of my bed and I'm gonna clean my room so it's currently I don't have my phone but last I checked it was 7 40 so I'm just gonna wash my face 
with this Mario Badescu seaweed cleansing soap and I'm going to use this retinol serum by Ellen Tracy. I don't know. And I'm just going to brush my teeth, but you already saw me do that yesterday. So I'm just going to show you washing my face. I'm gonna let it soak it in. I'm gonna find my moisturizer and then put that in. But that's all. I need to do something about my hair. And let's go make some coffee and some breakfast. Okay. Okay, so I just get back from making my food. I didn't make anything fancy. I just made two quesadillas with sausage. And a Capri Sun. I'm a, currently making my coffee beds in the fridge. Uh, I'm actually going to watch some Netflix. I'm probably going to watch Ginny and Georgia. And I want to be annoyed with everyone as well. So I have to watch it, right? And after that, I'm going to change. Like, do something with my hair. Nothing crazy, though. Change. And... I don't know nothing nothing interesting so I'll just come back when it's 11 and I have class okay so it's like actually hours later it's 10:54. I changed my hair getting ready to get onto my math zoom lecture which is at 11 all I've been doing is watching Netflix because I already finished my homework already kind of did everything so it just was enjoying myself so that's all for day two day three i'm gonna try to work out and maybe go out early morning i'm gonna try to work out tomorrow okay see you tomorrow Okay, it's been weeks since I tried to attempt that chaos or whatever of a challenge trying to wake up at 5 a.m. every day and the fact that I've tried filming and doing this challenge like three times already and I fail every single time means something. I realized that waking up at 5 a.m. or even trying to is super unconventional like especially living in a big household with a lot of family members because you especially because I don't have my own bathroom so getting up making noise would just be disturbing the house for no reason also it's dark outside so it's like if I turn on the lights they're gonna feel it like there's it's just super unconventional like at 5 a.m. and then like my classes don't start till 11 and it's like I that's so much time to like that's so much time and like by the time I like work out let's say and like eat a breakfast and like get like do like like I don't really have anything to do especially in quarantine like there's not much you can do so waking up at 5 a.m. just kind of doesn't make sense waking up maybe at 7 maybe 8 a.m. I could see people doing but for me it still doesn't even work like I enjoy my sleep I enjoy dreaming I enjoy that so for people who can do it good for them but for me that was just so it didn't like it just doesn't work out for my life situation like if i lived at my own place 
and like maybe like had a gym membership to wake up and go to yeah it would make sense like even just like going out to get coffee at 5 a.m when it's dark just doesn't seem safe you know so that is my conclusion of this 5 a.m challenge um yeah it doesn't work for me